One of my um, mistakes in the last few years was coming in from a couple of beers with my mates and going on to eBay late at night and it was while I was building my house and I was using a lot of um, earth moving equipment and we got towards the end of it and I thought I could really do with my own little dumper because I'd been renting one for weeks and weeks and weeks on end and spending a lot of money anyway so during my um, evening in front of the computer I accidentally bought this thing okay and I got into a little bit of a bidding war with someone probably the person I was buy buying it of and um, bought it and the very next day it was delivered okay and I paid close to three grand for this machine and on paper it will do everything I needed to do it's got a tipper on it that can actually scrape and clear and dig so you can go up against the pile of muck dig it and it will come back and it's articulated it steers and four-wheel drive hydraulic motors on each wheel and I thought this is going to save me 160 quid a week or whatever I was paying for one of those small one ton dumpers but even though it started and even though it went okay on level ground as soon as you tried to go up the slightest incline it just wouldn't go okay so I my garden's on a bit of a slope, so as soon as I tried to go straight up the garden, it just wouldn't go. It's been in my garage for the best part of two years, and uh, maybe three years, and it's just sat here, and I need to move it on now, okay? It needs someone who's good with hydraulics, because the engine is a Honda. It's absolutely fantastic, and it just starts, you know, no problem, it just goes. 390cc, um, it's a really good, good motor. But yeah, it just needs someone who can, um, mechanically minded, who can actually, you know, put it together. It's, it's, it's a wonderful tool, it even lifts as well, so a tip and a skip. Get it all working, it'll be absolutely fantastic, and it looks pretty mean as well. That was one of my biggest mistakes that I've ever made, um, buying something late at night after a couple of beers. So if you fancy a roughneck and you're pretty good with you know, mechanical things, hydraulics, I, I have no idea what you need to do to it, to just tune it in to make it go up a bit more of a steep incline. But um, yeah, maybe um, make me an offer. I'm happy to sell this for at least half of what I paid for it. So what do I give? I give about three grand for it. So yeah, I, I would accept half that. If anyone, Fancies it? Get in touch with me.